of what we've witnessed here? Well, I think Ireland showed also a bit too much respect. Uh, maybe that was uh, represented in the team selection by the manager by not playing Murphy and Walters up top or by not bringing Hulain in. Um, playing a, a central midfielder really in that number 10 position in Hendrik who is a very capable player but clearly when you try to accommodate players in, in the position they're not used to play um, it's always a tricky thing to do and it, it, it can backfire and for, for large parts Ireland did struggle I've got to say in the second half you can't fault them for their effort for their commitment for their for the courage this team got huge courage so I think if you speak to the Irish players in half an hour's time I think all of them will say we would love to play the game again because I think you've seen in the second half this is not that Austrian team that went with 28 points out of 30 through qualification uh, for the Euros this is a team that's struggling yes they've got capable footballers but when you put them under pressure I think they fell apart in the second half because there were uh, a penalty shout there was a goal there was two clear off the line there was a uh, disallowed goal so with really limited resources, Ireland created a, a huge amount of chances in the second half um, and I just wonder whether Ireland gave Austria too much respect in the end, a fair result but I think, if you look back at it I think it could or should have been three Eamon, 